text 22 the living entity in material nature thus follows the ways of life and join the three modes of nature this is due to his association with that material nature thus he meets with good and evil among various species this verse is very important for an understanding of how the living entities transmigrate from one body to another it is explained in the second chapter that the living entity is transmigrating from one body to another just as one changes dress this change of dress is due to his attachment to material existence as long as he is captivated by this false manifestation he has to continue transmigrating from one body to another due to his desire to lord it over material nature he is put into such undesirable circumstances under the influence of material desire the entity is born sometimes as a demigod sometimes as a man sometimes as a beast as a bird as a worm as an aquatic as a saintly man as a bug this is going on and in all cases the living entity thinks himself to be the master of his circumstances yet he is under the influence of material nature how he is put into such different bodies is explained here it is due to association with different modes of nature one has to rise therefore above the three material modes and become situated in the transcendental position this is called krishna consciousness unless one is situated in krishna consciousness his material consciousness will oblige him to transfer from one body to another because he has material desires since time immemorial but he has to change that conception that change can be effected only by hearing from authoritative sources the best example is here arjun is hearing the signs of god from krishna the living entity if he submits to this hearing process will lose his long cherished desire to dominate material nature and gradually and proportionately as he reduces his desire to dominate he comes to enjoy spiritual happiness in a vedic mantra it is said that he becomes learned in association with the supreme personality of godhead he proportionately relishes his eternal blissful life